Hi, we are at the Los Angeles International Gang Convention here. If you could just give me your name and a little bit about you. My name is Sinead Polk and I work with Second Call. I've been home two years now from doing a 17 years on a 15 of life sentence. And I'm doing a lot of great work here at the LA Gang Conference 2017. So if you want to just give us a little bit about yourself, um, the little five minute elevator pitch that you gave us earlier on, that would be fantastic. Absolutely. My brother, shot and killed by the police when I was 12. My cousin, killed in a motorcycle accident while another brother in prison. My father, he died when I was 17. Pain, the one thing I realized we can all relate to and understand. As a result of my pain and not knowing how to deal with my unresolved trauma, I served 17 years in prison. I used to be inmate W80854. Now, I am Sinead Polk, the program director at Second Call. Second Call stands for Second Chances at Loving Life, and we hold nine trauma-informed classes a week throughout Los Angeles. Because our curriculum was developed by an ex-felon and ex-gang member, we are effective in developing and transforming those that society throws away. In our emotionally safe classes, we guide one through childhood, adolescent years, and adulthood, shedding away layers of hurt and pain. Removing this excess baggage allows us to teach how to function beyond dysfunction. After the mind is healthy, the behavior changes, then we offer union careers to assist in rebuilding Los Angeles. Our program is also an organization that provides free, quarter-proof classes. Judges are specifically sending people to second cause classes instead of jail, and that is allowing us to reconstruct our communities from the inside out. Take Little Man, released from prison 2013, known gang member, arrested for first degree murder, assault with a deadly weapon, carjacking. Now 68% of prisoners who are let out are rearrested within three years of release. Out of the 825 men and women second call served last year, our return rate was 2% and Little Man was not one of them. Healing is the key. A doctor is not going to place a band-aid on a gunshot victim. A surgery is going to take place. I am not going to place a band-aid on unresolved trauma. A surgery is going to take place, mentally. We take our participants through where I'm from, that's week one, and we have them talk about childhood and understand why they do what they do. We end with a very powerful forgiveness letter. By the end of the letter, they let go of all resentment. Little Man and myself, we went to second call and an operation was performed on us. Little Man is now Charles and he's known as a taxpayer, a father, and a community member. Me, will I stand before you today no longer a victim or an offender? I am an advocate, a peacemaker. I am a second chance. So join second call in helping develop healthy minds throughout our world. That is absolutely amazing. We hope to learn from you, um, you know, look at your trauma programs, which I'm already going to be coming and meeting Skip on Thursday, looking forward to that. And, uh, you know, carrying on this international link. Absolutely. Working together with the UK will be absolutely phenomenal taking us out there, you guys coming out here, being able to see what works and actually collaborate and work together would be fantastic. It's all about making a positive difference to young people, changing lives, you know, saving lives and making a massive difference. Yes, definitely. Getting the kids active, sports, great thing to allow them to actually release some of that tension, any type of built up anger, don't go to the streets. Um, take it to the ring, take it to the field, anywhere where they can have a positive, le learn team skills, learn from a coach, from mentors. It's, it's definitely a wonderful thing to put teenagers, active, active youth into our community. Fantastic. Thank you for your time. Thank you very much.